Hey guys, in this video I want to talk about DHEA, okay? This is a really potent steroid found in our body and both men and women need this steroid, okay? So almost 90% of this uh, steroid is synthesized by the adrenal glands, okay? So if if you are low in DHEA and DHES, okay, it's a sulfated form, okay, if you do, next time if you do blood test, uh, get check your DHEA and DHES, okay, because one is DHEA and the second one is a sulfated uh, form. So you can see the first signs uh, of adrenopause, okay, because we have uh, menopause and all these kind of things, but there is also adrenopause, okay? So your adrenal glands are not working as they should be. And DHEA is extremely important because more than 40% uh, of all androgens are uh, created from DHEA, okay? So DHEA itself only... Uh, only create around 5% of circulating testosterone. But generally, if you are low in testosterone, but you are good or your level of DHEA are okay, then you will create extra testosterone because there are three ways. I already told you, there are three ways how testosterone is uh, created itself, directly or primary from cholesterol, okay, then from DHEA, and also you can create DHT even without testosterone via backdoor pathway, okay? So you have three ways how you can make testosterone, okay? So don't try to, don't try to uh, eliminate one of these pathway, okay? Because it's really helpful for your body, okay? So benefits, DHEA. The, Probably the number one benefit is muscle mass and fat loss, okay? Because uh, if your levels are okay, you will get much leaner body, okay? So if your levels are depleted, you will have a little bit problem and you will also gain weight, okay? What also I need to tell you about DHEA is that if you are under the stress, a lot of DHEA will be... Uh, will be transformed into uh, estrogen, okay? Uh, DHEA is aromatized in estrogen, okay? It's okay, uh, it works like this, but the if your body is under chronic stress, even applying DHEA in order to fix issue, a lot of this DHEA can be converted into estrogen, okay? so. Uh, there are ways how you can, uh, there are workarounds for this, yes, but be careful if you are in chronic stress, in chronic state, state of inflammation, a lot of uh, exogenous DHEA can be converted to uh, estrogen because uh, from my clients I get uh, always get this information like I took DHEA and my estrogen skyrocket it's because of this and also if you take it if you take wrong uh, form of DHEA you can also create more estrogen okay because DHEA aromatize also in estrogen in testosterone DHT but also in estrogen okay uh, also insulin sensitivity okay if your DHEA is okay then you will have also insulin sensitivity will be okay, okay? So it's vasorelaxant, okay? So better reaction, better performance in gym, DHEA, okay? So immune system, uh, cardiovascular health, uh, health, and what I really like on DHEA is, DHEA is affecting REM sleep, and REM sleep is the most important thing for your testosterone level, and also for your erection, okay? Because normally we have this nocturnal uh, erection during the REM phase of our sleep. The longer, the better, okay? So uh, you will have 
increase in testosterone and you will get harder erections okay so how we can increase DHEA okay so we can add exogenous DHEA here we need to be careful because uh, because like I said if you are under chronic inflammation under chronic stress you can aromatize a lot of DHEA into estrogen okay so what I always see as a problem when I check my clients is that uh, if they get a uh, dosage is too, mostly too high okay so I see especially in the women but also in the men that sometimes the dosage is crazy okay so it's not should be that high okay so always you need to start low and what's also important it's a form of dhda okay so what i really like for example as a natural solution i was talking a lot about tribulus but you need to get high quality tribulus and if you and you need to know how to how to test uh, how to cycle tribulus properly okay always do guys always do blood test okay so don't try any supplement without blood test or any consultation it can be with me or medical doctor okay so don't try supplements without doing blood work or something you don't know your current state maybe everything is okay you're just feeling tired or so you can fix it other way okay so before you start with supplements, always take blood test, okay? So, tribulus is extremely great and what's even better is combination with silagit or mumio, okay? Also, high quality silagit or mumio because I see a lot of junk. Uh, most of my clients are really buying a lot of junk and they see no results, okay? So, and for both, for silagit, mumio, uh, tribulus you need to cycle okay you need to cycle properly uh tribulus and silagit they work in synergy okay so also silagit uh it's increasing atp but i think also your your body energy is also coming from supporting adrenal glands because silagit is adaptogen strong adaptogen adaptogen that is supporting adrenal uh, glands okay so it's extremely important maybe uh, you are thinking right now but i am 25 years old okay i have seen my last client was 27 years old and his dhes was on the lower end okay so really really low even if his testosterone was good but his dhea was really low it also helps uh, with energy and so if you can improve your uh, adrenals and adrenal health okay because they also produce androgen guys okay so not only testes and what i really love is vitamin c okay so because vitamin c supports uh, proper function of adrenals okay so uh, if also if your cortisol is high vitamin c is helping with that because it also improves the ratio between DHEA and cortisol okay so guys if you like this video hit the like button leave some comment in order to push this video in algorithm and let me know your thoughts bye